When I think back, my sister and I sit and think back of our childhood days, wonderful days. We had a lovely family. My brothers adored us. My father adored our daughters. Uh, and uh, we were looked after very well. We became, as we grew up, we took charge of the home, home itself, uh, managing the house. I was the oldest. My brothers would come and consult or give the money to me and manage it, you know, uh, that kind. My elder brother was an uh, engineer. He was a top man in the post in Malaysia. At that time, they needed youngsters and all that. Then the Malaysian government sent him to UK, first high commissioner there. And then the second was a principal of a school, and third was a planter in, tea planter in Sri Lanka. Fourth was another, this uh, filming, filming industry, high post. They all had good posts, and they were very loving brothers. They looked after us, and they finally arranged marriage for us. That is also a fate. Although my sister and I said, we don't want to marry, we don't want to marry, but we were practically forced by our next go in and get married. <laughs> we married quite late in life also, not early. So I don't think I regretted anything. I, I, I don't want to have all the money and live a high life and uh, be unhappy somehow or other. Happiness lies in the family, and how you manage the family is important. Although I went through some difficulties, everybody goes through finance difficulty or some difficulties at times. But these are ups and downs if you know how to face it. My husband was also a Malaysian. He came to Singapore to work. But at that time, it was all one. But uh, later, uh, Singapore broke up and became Singapore separate. And we were Malaysians, so arranged marriage was done. So I came over here and got married to him. And we stayed in JB, Johor Bahru. And from Johor Bahru, I, my husband would travel to Woodlands to work, and I would teach in St. Joseph's. Until in 1971, uh, Singapore government wanted teachers from Malaysia, the short of teachers. Then we, I applied and I came in. So we used to travel down to have the baby. Or medical checkup for baby, I used to travel every weekend to come and see uh, Professor Ratnam for medical checkup. And all. Finally, for delivery too, I had to come here and deliver the baby so that she will become a Singapore citizen. And she was, I think, the youngest baby to have a little passport to go back 